in case I have any uh, leftover cement, I've just created some little shoes that I'm going to try and cast in cement. Um, I'll just, so these are the, I love to go to um, op shops and I'm really into trying to recycle, uh, I don't know, things that people discard. So I try and give it a new lease of life and a new meaning in life. So these are some little pairs of shoes that I've got out of the um, Nambo op shop going to if I've got any leftover cement, cast the cement inside them. So what I've done is I've taken the shoelaces out and tried to put them on the inside. So hopefully when I do the cement pour, the shoelaces, although concave, will, will show the, um, you know, the little laces done up. And I have siliconed it and glued the shoelaces to the inside of the shoe. I don't know if we can see that very, whoops, very well. And oops, there we go. And um, I'm not going to wait for that to dry now. And the same with this one here. I've taken the little um, side, little side straps off here, and I've glued them onto the inside. And they had little blow bows on the outside here, so I've cut them off and glued them on the inside. And then when I hopefully those impressions will, uh, you know, show when when I'm casting it in the um, cement. So. I'm, not too sure just how or how I'm going to finish decorating it, but I thought, well, I'll give that a go. And I have used um, Sally's All Clear just to do the buttonholes here to stop the cement from coming out. It will be interesting. And to get them out of the shoe, the shoes are going to have to be destroyed, of course, and I'll cut them away and we'll see what happens next. <laughs> 